Welcome back to the Inspiring Wit TV YouTube channel. I'm Janelle and I'm really glad that you're going to be joining me for this little video. It is, as I'm sure you can see in the title, a haul video from Mango. Uh, I'm not really big on hauls to be honest, but I bought six items, which for me is like a haul, that's a lot, um, from Mango and it was the first time I'd ordered with them online so I wanted to do a little review of that and show you the pieces that I got. It was during their 30% off sale, so I wanted to make the most of it because my wish list was ridiculous with really, really cool pieces that I wanted to buy. And I managed to whittle it down by half, I think, um, because I was like, just not gonna commit that many dollars or buy that many items that I probably actually didn't need. But I loved everything that I got. Almost like 100%, but almost. We'll go through it. I watched a lot of YouTube videos of other people's mango hauls to see what they really liked. And I took a long time to look at the website and work out whether uh, the fabrics were what I would be wanting. Um, to pick things that were really versatile that I'd wear for years and that would mix and match with my other clothes. I really wanted to go with as many pieces from their committed collection as I could. Um, which uses things like organic cotton. I've just filmed an IGTV video because I've been doing styling videos twice a week um, on my IGTV channel. Uh, so please check that out. If you haven't already seen them, please check it out. Uh, so I'm going to be cutting in bits of the video from that to the side here so you can see what the pieces look like. So first of all, I'm wearing this um, gathered t-shirt. It's the clone t-shirt. Uh, it was made from organic cotton. I really liked it. It was $20 um, Australian dollars. Uh, I think I was going to go with one of those padded t-shirts but I wasn't quite sure if I have, this sounds really silly, but literally wasn't sure if I would have a long enough neck or thin enough neck to really pull that off. Because I'm kind of petite size, if I got those padded um, t-shirts, there's the potential for it to be like up here on me and not look cool at all. But I loved this alternative. So it doesn't have shoulder pads, it's just gathered and sits nicely in the similar sort of style. I've tucked it into my um, pants here and I, I just love it, it was a great tuck. Uh, I'm wearing that with the Bellina trousers. Um, a cotton trouser, they were 55 or $56. Um, with the sale and I love them. I think it's just the perfect colour. There were a couple of colours from memory. Um, they're just, yeah, nice cotton alternative to wearing jeans. Alright, so I was so obsessed with these. And I actually saw them first in white and ended up deciding at the last minute to get the black version. Now I'm kind of tempted to order the, the white as well. So they're a knotted uh, or a braided sandal. I guess in the Bottega style, but I actually prefer these to the potato ones. So they have a slight point, like a tapering point at the front. They fit very snugly. I sized down to a 38, which is usually what I get when I buy um, strappy heels. And if I'm wearing boots or enclosed shoes, I go for a size 39. I love that. Oh, so good. Right, yeah, 10 out of 10 for me for actually all of the things I've showed you so far. These pants, the white shirt, and the heels are just so cool. So I love these sunglasses uh, of the model. There I wanted um, this olive green kind of colour um, sunglass. So they are the Natalie sunglasses and they were $32 or $31.50. Um, I think they're really, they're really good for what it is. For 30 bucks. Like these were, I had a look uh, these ones have some UV protection or like more UV protection than what uh, was mentioned on some of the other sunglasses, which is really important for Australia. Um, I think it still came with a warning to say that our UV rays are strong, so it's not going to cover you for all of your UV protection. Um, but yeah, when I saw that this pair had some UV at least protection on them, I decided to get this one as opposed to a couple of the other cheaper ones I was looking at, which were really cool, but um, yeah, like, that's just so important here. Uh, I can't compromise on it, so even compromising a little bit 
is a big deal. So they're a lightweight acrylic, not as like, I guess the only other pair of sunglasses I can really compare to are um, my pairs from Chimmy, uh, which are a lot thicker. They've got like the metal um, in their arms to make them more reinforced. And they are the same thickness in quality, so it was why I thought these might be kind of similar. Um, but yeah, these have got to me, glasses are just so well priced by how good the quality is to try it out and see whether I wear them. So it's just like the perfect way to do that, I guess, and wear it for a bit. And then if I come across a pair that I really love from a designer like or a brand like Chini, then I'll probably invest more in them. If something else hadn't a fit, I probably would have sent these back just because I'm such a stickler for quality. But I'd say that I like 80% happy with them, but I have probably too higher an expectation because I've been so spoiled by these pairs that I love from Chimmy. So I kept them uh, because everything fit perfectly. Yeah. Um, the next thing that I got is two more, and I got all of these things to mix and match between each other. So first is this linen top, which is the liner, uh, liner, liner top. It is literally just a v-neck on the back and the front. It was $20 as well and I love it. It's like a really light um, linen. You, I think that was part of the considered collection, or committed collection as well. It's sheer so you have to wear a bra underneath um, but I love it. It's really elegant on, perfect to be tucked in. And then finally, I got one more pair of jeans which are very similar to a slouch jean that I was looking at at Zara. So these are Regina slouch jeans. They were $55.90. Made in Morocco, they're a good size. I went for a size 34. It is perfect on me. I, I, I love them. They're not organic cotton, um, so I guess that's where the Zara was probably would have won for me. Um, and I liked the feel of them when I went in. Uh, if they hadn't been in stock, I just would have ordered those. Um, I think they're $60 or something, so similar sort of price. Um, well, similar price on these are 30% off, so yeah, I'm not really sure why this wasn't more competitive in price. But if you know the ones that I'm talking about, those slouch jeans from Zara, this is an alternative if they've sold out and you want a pair. I am happy that they have 30% off. Otherwise, I would have got, wouldn't have got them. The fit is perfect on me. They're exactly what I wanted. Um, I love the color. I needed a lighter sort of denim that was slouched like this. They aren't permanently cuffed. They've just been rolled up in a cuff. That was how they came in the packaging. But I think that they look really good. Up or down. That's all that I got. So six pieces. I feel like I've already talked a lot. I might have to cut some of that down. Overall, I will order from Mango again. It was a really good experience. I didn't have any issues whatsoever. They used um, recycled packaging and very little extra packaging inside. Uh, the shoes came in a recycled box that was just similar to the outer packaging. It wasn't like a fancy shoe box or anything. It was just like a simple chuck away box as you usually do. I don't really tend to keep my shoe boxes. Um, the outer packaging was recycled as well. The clothes did come in plastic, unfortunately. Um, it would be great if they were just wrapped in paper, but I think you only get that from some smaller companies. Um, for fast fashion, I think the quality was amazing and I'm really happy with that. Uh, my camera just died on me. Probably talking too much. Thanks, camera. Um, don't know what I got up to, but essentially I was really happy with what I bought from Mango and I will order from them again. Um, it came really fast and everything was amazing. The quality was great. The pieces all fit me really well. Uh, yeah. Let me know if you have any questions or suggestions in the comments below. Please subscribe. I'm going to keep making more videos, or at least that's the plan. Um, I have videos coming out on my IGTV channel every Monday and Thursday, so please head over and follow me on Inspiring Wit. And thank you in advance. Uh, and I will see you next time.
have a great rest of the month.